Do not allow yourself to be owned by this edifice. Do not sign over your latitude of action to the hands of the swampists above it who will misdeploy, experiment upon, and in the end, abandon you. For the best liberty-oriented talk 24-7, visit lrn.fm. The unwelcome occupation of seemingly or, uh, or seemingly continuous bombardment of now seven odd sovereign and largely non-threatening states if the new america magazine is to be believed one aerial fed bomb dropped in anger every twelve minutes while we the innocent are restricting from even possessing so much as a short shotgun we have also to contemplate the torturous and even medievalist treatment of fierce and formerly friendly tribesmen who have never been conquered, or worse, their young offspring, their weddings, their ambulances, the homes and diggings of these Pashtuns and Uzbeks, loyally defended, were already well recognized as the graveyard of empires whose codes of honor, though alien and not without cruelty, were, even, even when this army was most justified against them, dismissed, if even recognized. To the hubris of this conqueror, housed and represented in the building before me, has been added the odious and doubtful expedient of the torture chamber, Torture, uh, uh, torture chamber once officially renounced, now uh, brazenly endorsed by this empire's top ruler. <laughs> the army which I denounce, <laughs> I see uh, hooting me. <laughs> uh, maybe they do not know what I am saying. <laughs> I see none, or would show you. Mm. Perhaps. Uh, they will show themselves. <clears throat> uh, mm. We have respect the country's old lion, uh, contemplate torturous, even medievalist stuff. Give us a portrait chamber. Once officially, announced, uh, once, uh, once officially announced, now brazenly endorsed by this empire's uh, top ruler. The old lion, whose accoutrements I mimic, perhaps badly at this moment served in these very locations, recognized as you do the primitivist shortcomings of the Afghan and tribal Pakistani peoples, who will join the civilized world when their privations at its hands are at an end and when it is their wish, and not before. But it is his way, the old lions and Mr. Churchill's, or to respect or comfort these, even when they were exchanging detonations or prostrate and wounded before his regiment, and to criticize in print and at his own peril those regrettable abuses he witnessed against the Islamic peoples and at the hands of his London masters. How regrettable as well would be a decision by any one of you entering uh, this facility to affix yourself to it and to the wicked ends it has been pursuing at such ruinous expenditure. Do not allow yourself to be owned by this edifice. Do not sign over your latitude of action to the hands of the swampists above it who will misdeploy, experiment upon, and in the end Abandon you. LRN programs is very nice. They're so great, I like them twice. Some people don't take LRN's advice, but they're softer than Alex Jones and louder than mice. 
LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them.